Hi, happy everyone. Here I am today, vlogging here down the lovely Essex here today, the Dumb on the Seaside again today. A bit cloudy today. Now let's look at a, an amazing magician, Sergio Mayweather. Well, so it's an amazing magician. This magician is Franz Harari. He's a very famous American magician. I did a video before about Franz for Harari, okay? He's a good friend of Copperfield. He's performed with many, many big illusion shows, okay? Creating illusions to Michael Jackson, Copperfield, okay? For many, many pop stars, including Tina Turner and T-Pack, okay? He's a great illusionist, okay? He's, he's does an amazing show, I think, in Las Vegas and Macau and Hong Kong and also Florida and many, many places. So sit back and relax and look at this. He's amazing, Franz Ferrara's amazing, innovative and clever magic show he created about five years ago for, for my channel. So sit back, relax, and welcome back to the amazing magic of American sensation illusionist, creative inventor, Franz Harari. Let's have a look at this, and this is an amazing video. Let's analyze Franz Harari's magic. Here we're gonna go. Francis, Francis, really good, is a really good magician, seriously, I love France, okay, I've seen France myself personally, he performed in Northrop, Las Vegas, he performed around the world, he's actually been a big magician, seriously, for Fran, France Harari, okay, his name is spent F-R-A-N-Z, H-R-A-L-Y, okay, France for Harari, okay, not France Ferrari, France Harari, okay, and let's say he's a great magician, seriously, now let's have a look, a little look in detail at some of the big illusions we do in the last five years or so, he's performing, I think, in a venue here in Florida, okay, about five years ago, this is some really amazing illusions, okay, and obviously on my channel I was vlogging and vlogging and analysing big, massive illusions, Illusions, okay, this is no exception today. So let's look at this amazing illusions from the show from Hans Harari about five or six years ago, performing in a theme park, I think, a uh, Magic Kingdom or somewhere, a Disney kind of theme park, I think it was in a Florida ba area, basically. Very interesting, indeed, seriously. Now let's have a look at this illusions, so seriously, with Franz Harari. Now, Franz, of course, is a big magician. He worked with Copperfield back in the 1980s, illusions. He also himself vanished an aeroplane, okay, he vanished a space shuttle as well. Check out my video of Franz Harari's vanished a space shuttle, okay, it's very interesting indeed. And also, he vanished other objects as well, including, I think, he vanished a jet plane as well, seriously. So many many illusions okay now in this illusion show anyway it did very recently good old Franz uh, Franz Harari does some interesting stuff including okay quite interesting including uh, an illusion where it gets cremated okay in stage okay and also gets resurrected again okay a bit like Jesus Christ it's interesting so <laughs> okay so let's, let's look at analysis quite carefully on this amazing show of the Franz Harari from five years ago performing I think as it was in Florida let's, let's have a look at this show let's kick off okay with the first illusion the first illusion does in this show is an interesting illusion called the UFO it's a weird illusion that's it before a kind of UFO appears in stage okay and basically the open up and closes up itself by magic, okay. And when it opens up, you can see inside it or around nothing inside it at all. And yet, amazingly, okay, when it closes and opens up entirely, right, would you believe it? And when, the, when it opens up and closes entirely, quite amazingly, okay, all right, the actual someone pops out of the UFO, France pops out of the UFO. It's a really weird illusion, okay, called the UFO illusion. It's very freaky, interesting, very, very uh, dramatic, much dramatic, also very well designed, okay. Have a look at this now. This is a very unique, unique and unusual, very well designed illusion called the UFO appearance. Listen, that's what I love. That's really good. That wasn't another one. Next up, okay, list of illusions that France does in this show. It's a really impressive show, isn't it? It's an illusion I like actually quite a lot called the Vanishing Motorcycle. We've so, seen motorcycles being disappeared, vanished by magicians over the years. Of course, most famously, Doug Henry back in the 1980s, who made in the 70s, made a, did the biggest illusion ever at the time, which was to vanish a motorcycle. Now, this illusion, anyway, is an interesting illusion. 
where basically you get some motorcycle on stage and they put it on a big platform basically raise up in the air like this okay all right and the motorcycle completely disappears entirely okay out of nowhere okay in the middle of the stage dances around the place and the stage lifts up and down see right around the whole illusion underneath it above it and everything else and the motorcycle disappears right through everybody else, everybody's eyes it's really quite a nice illusion again so check this out now okay this is a nice version uh franz does of the vanishing motorcycle updated with amazing neon kind of backdrops and kind of laser beam kind of backdrops and amazing kind of lcd screen okay LCD screens are very impressive indeed. so have a look at this now this is LCD screens amazing visuals Next up, we can listen to Illusionist series, ladies and gentlemen. I really like it, actually. It's called the Cube, actually. It's got a really, really weird illusion called the Cube. Guess a big human stage, basically, and it floats up in the air. I don't know how exactly it floats, it's close to the wires or anything. It floats around the whole stage, okay? It's a big cube thing, and it goes into a kind of V shaped box, basically, okay? And then out of the cube appears a beautiful girl. It's a really lovely illusion, actually. I don't know exactly how it works. It's a lovely illusion, sir. It's quite innovative and clever from the mind of France. France is so innovative and clever, seriously. We always comes up with new illusions, France does. Really get new kind of ideas and techniques in magic. That's why it's so creative, okay? This guy, seriously. So relax and sit back as always and have a look at this amazing illusion, Floating Cube K. Very innovative, very artistic, very clever from Franz Ferrara's amazing stage show. Have a look at this. And also, okay, Francis have a quite strong illusion caught in this show called the cremation illusion, actually. And this is really weird, actually. I don't even, I don't recommend this illusion. It's kind of very interesting, seriously. It gets a big um, box of stage, basically, like a, like a, basically like a coffin on stage. And Franz gets in the coffin, okay, they set up the coffin of fire, okay. The coffin burns up entirely. Franz burns for cinder, disappears entirely, and then reappears later on on a kind of uh, massive kind of bowl of fire. It's a really interesting illusion, okay.
okay. But the cremation illusion was done actually, it's quite a rare illusion actually. It's good to see it when we've done the show. Actually, this was done by Paul Randall's 30 odd years ago on his show back in the UK, and also was done. Uh, remember 30, 40 years ago by a magician called Simon Drake on a very dark magic show called The Secret Cabaret. You might remember The Secret Cabaret, it was on Channel 4. I think it was actually banned back at the time, Secret Cabaret. It's quite a freaky dark magic show with a very good magician called Simon Drake. Check out Simon Drake as well, he's a very good magician. I think he's quite old now as well, Simon Drake. Must have been in his 60s now. Anyway, sit back, relax, and watch this bit of magic. Now, this is a weird bit of freaky magic with the lovely, great Franz Rory. As he does the kind of freaky and weird, but illusion that's called a cremation illusion, okay? We get burnt to a cinder. Don't try this at home, okay? As I said before, this is just an illusion. It's not really, it's just Illusion. So here it is, Franz doing the cremation sequence from an extraordinary, amazing show. Have a look at this. It actually appears they've all that kind of podium, okay, kind of circular podium, set it on fire, okay, and out from the fire podium appears Franz Rory, appearing from nowhere, like a kind of resurrection basically. This guy's the Jesus Christ of magic, he appears from nowhere. So here he is, uh, the big bowl of fire, Franz pops out of nowhere, it's quite a strong illusion. Here's the fire bowl, big illusion again, done the Franz Rory show. Have a look at this as well. Really good. Okay, and also Franz likes to do a bit of stuff with cars. This is a lovely version of a car appearance. I think strong kind of Ranger also appears on stage. He has a big sort of framework up behind the scenes there. And basically what he does is he kind of has a big curtain raised and curtain drops and out from nowhere appears a giant big car. It's a giant kind of Range Rover, kind of Land Rover kind of car, big car seriously. So have a look at this now. This is a very impressive, but technically very interesting. In fact, again, I can't say this works. Smoke mirrors, I don't know exactly how it works. Let me know in the comments below if you know this works. Here's a very nice version of Franz's show of the appearing giant car. Have a look at this.
that's another one that's really good as well, seriously. And find a car if they're pairing car. If you don't have, have that car pairs, let me know in the comments below, seriously. Even I don't know how some of these tricks are done. I know a lot of illusions over the years, we need magic 40 years. And even I don't, I don't know how all the illusions are done. So it's pretty impressive stuff, isn't it, seriously. And find a K, there's a nice version of a, of a skate box, a Dean skate box. This is a thing, a similar trick was done by a magician, I think, called Raul Algeria, a Spanish magician, I think it is, on a, a video I did recently, Raul Algeria. Check out my videos on Raul Algeria. I think he's a Spanish Latino magician, very good indeed, seriously. Here is a very good version of the Houdini escape box, done by Houdini 120 odd years ago. This is where basically what happens is uh, France is put into a big box, okay? His hands stick out through the box. You see his hands all the time. He's chained up and everything in the box. Hands are visible all the time. The box goes up in the air and it blows open. Bush opens up entirely. Hands completely disappear entirely. Middle of, middle of nowhere and appears in the audience, okay? It's a good illusion, seriously. It's a good old uh, explosion box station appearing in the audience illusion. Done again. It's a classic in magic, isn't it? I said many people do this kind of illusion.
I know Francis Ferrari's got his own channel, and Francis did magic for obviously about four, four decades. He's actually uh, born in 1963, I think he was. So he's about uh, 59 years old or so. So he's quite an older guy now, older than me. But he's a great magician, blonde hair, look, nice guy, seriously. I love this guy, seriously. He's done some really good magic. Check out him on YouTube. He's done many, many illusions, including vanishing an aeroplane, vanishing a jet, also vanishing a space shuttle as well. So he's done many, many big illusions, okay? And he's a great magician. Also, as I say, he worked with many big stars, as I say, in magic. I think he worked also not only with Michael Jackson, he worked with Usher, he worked with two. Pack, remember Tupac? He worked with him, he worked with Boy, I think he worked with Boys to Men, he worked with Tina Turner, he worked with many, many artists, so seriously, okay, over the years, particularly Michael Jackson as well, and doing illusions of Michael Jackson. I think he even worked on Victory Show back in 1983 with Michael Jackson, Michael Jackson 5, okay. So he did many, many big shows and many, many big uh, artists over the years, seriously, many big music artists. I think he also worked with MC Hammer as well. Remember MC Hammer? You can't touch this, okay? So he worked with many, many artists, okay, over the, over the 90s and 2000s, basically, he's a big magician. And he, I, I think he's even doing uh, sort of stores, I think he's also looking at history magic as well, making stuff in the history of magic. He's a great magician, seriously. Check him out on YouTube, seriously. This is a great show looking at a modern illusionist. And now that Copperfield are kind of still performing and Secret Wars disappeared in the tide, it's great to see these big illusion shows still going with really clever, innovative and clever illusion services. I love that kind of stuff, seriously. Anyway, look up to yourself. So I hope you enjoyed the little vlog I made there on the great Franz Ferrari. A great magician, seriously. One of the best magicians in the world. Still going at the age of about 60 years old or so. I love Franz. Hi, Franz. I love your magic, seriously. Watch the video, Franz. I love your magic, seriously. Okay? Okay. So I hope you I do love the video. Anyway, look up to yourselves, guys out there. Please subscribe. Please do okay. Please like as well. Please do as always. So to help the channel out, please do. Remember, subscription is completely free, okay? It's free to subscribe. So please subscribe for free. Please do the channel as always. And remember, click links below for 200 videos I made a Magic Chat Illusion. Please do many, many videos I made. Biographies of magicians from Franz Harawa to Chris Angel to Copperfield to Paul Daniels to everyone. So please, please check the channel out. Please do as all as always. Okay. In the meantime, look after yourselves. Please subscribe. See you again very, very soon for more Magic and Chat and Illusion. See you later and bye for now.